The first images from the James Webb Space Telescope reveal God's creation and feed our souls. Brother Guy Consormagno, a Jesuit brother and astronomer, said on July the 14th in response to the publication of the four new scientific images that were recently published. The James Webb Telescope is a collaboration between NASA, the European Space Agency, and the Canadian Space Agency. It launched in December after more than two decades of development and observes the universe from a spot in space on the other side of the moon, 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. The James Webb Telescope observes the cosmos in infrared wavelengths, which gives it a different view from that of many other observatories, such as the Hubble Space Telescope. Webb's 6.5 meter wide mirror is the largest ever launched into space. Brother Guy Consormagno is the director of the Vatican Observatory since 2015 and has said that the science behind this telescope is our attempt to use our God-given intelligence to understand the logic of the universe. He has also pointed out the historic contributions of churchmen throughout the centuries and has pointed to fellow Jesuit astronomer, Father Angelo Secchi in particular. Father Secchi was the first person to put a prism in front of his telescope lens, and he did it on the roof of the St. Ignatius Church in Rome. He also made the first spectral measurements of the atmospheres of the planets in our own solar system. This science that he pioneered was later used in the James Webb Space Telescope. Many of these innovations were also first pioneered by the Vatican Observatory, with its roots dating all the way back to 1582. The Vatican Observatory is one of the oldest active astronomical observatories in the world, with its headquarters in Castel Gandolfo, a town just outside of Rome, and the location of the summer residence of the popes. While we're experiencing the awe of the Webb Telescope, Brother Guy reminds us to be grateful to God that he has given humans, his creation, the ability to see and understand what he has done.